Today's tour is not just another country estate. No, 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 it is four acres of pristine landscaping that blends in beautifully with the natural trees and terrain of Bear's Paw itself, creating this, your very own private oasis. Not to mention this stunning 7,000 square foot home. All of this coming up today on this episode of Million Dollar Tours. We're out in Bear's Paw and from this house right here, you're only seven minutes to the city's edge, even though it feels like you are in your own universe. Now from here, you've got great schools nearby, amenities, the Bear's Paw Golf Course, and you're a short distance out to the Rocky Mountains themselves. This is a perfect home for a family and people who value seclusion and privacy. We'll take you up behind the home where you'll see just how incredible these grounds are. There has been over a million dollars worth invested into this property to bring it out to its full potential. However, rather than looking over the top, it's all been made to blend in beautifully with the natural terrain. Take a look at these large field stones, these steps, this care and attention that has been dedicated to this land. I absolutely love it. This field stone is actually vertical, so you can use it as a handrail as you proceed to the back of your yard. So Teal's supposed to meet me back here, but uh, while she's walking around the grounds, because they've actually carved in a natural footpath around the entirety of this property, I thought I'd show you the rear of this home. It is stunning. You get so much natural wildlife back here. Oh, there's a cougar now. So funny, Brad. I'm talking about this, the cougar statue that overlooks this beautiful fountain in the center of your flat level yard. Back here, come on, Tila, couldn't you see our kids getting married, spending summers back here. There's even room for a pool. It is a perfect oasis with tons of privacy and shelter from the wind. As incredible as it is outside, we cannot wait to show you the inside of this McKinley Master custom-built home. It is stunning in here. We have over 4,600 square feet on the main and the second floor. This home features main floor living, absolutely beautiful custom features throughout, five wood-burning fireplaces, and a finished basement with nearly 2,400 square feet. Plus, all around you through this home, you get that sense of we are here in Alberta. We are close to those gorgeous Rocky Mountains and you see that throughout with the stone accents and just check out this room and that fireplace behind us. But first, let's take a look at the kitchen. Okay, we don't want this video to be an hour long, so we're gonna try to stick to just the highlights, but it's hard to pass by a space like this without mentioning another gorgeous wood-burning fireplace makes this cool dining and eating area, which is a place where you know a lot of people entertain, nice and cozy too. Another cool feature here, right off the kitchen and the dining is you can step out onto your covered deck. Now that deck it is amazing because it frames in those views beautifully, has another fireplace and even access through a spiral staircase down to your yard. This is a French country inspired kitchen featuring vintage details like this cabinetry, the crown moldings, and then this beautiful stonework over top of the gas range. Yes, but don't let those beautiful finishes fool you because this kitchen is also outfit with all of the modern conveniences. So take a look at this. Behind this beautiful door, this cabinetry face finish is the fridge. It even has drawers. This is a Sub-Zero appliance. In-wall melee appliances back there. Now you might be wondering, where's the freezer? Well, don't worry, it's right here in the island with some more drawer style appliances right there trash compactors, even the outlets are outfit with USB plugs. They've thought of everything in this space. Now it also has a couple of really unique design features, both the dual island with this tall bank of cabinets, kind of close the mess while you're baking or entertaining. And then this island right here. Tila, what would you do with this sink when you had friends over? I think you'd fill it with ice and put a ton of drinks in there. That's what I would do, right? Or you know what, maybe just in the morning, you grab a coffee, you sit down, you watch the TV right there. Either way, this is set up for how people live. Before we move on from this kitchen, Brad, you have got to talk about these countertops because I am in love. Oh, what is not to love, Tila? These have beautiful blue veining that I have never seen before in a kitchen. I don't know why it works so, so well in here if it's the blue knobs on the gas range or just the simple fact that these countertops themselves are art pieces. 
So the wing of the home that is just off the kitchen here is also super practical. We've got a great country inspired pantry in here, open shelf, tons of room for appliances, a tucked away home office that's also right off that entrance you can see when deliveries are arriving. So as beautiful as the home is, it's only as good as it functions. You've got these great slate floors, you can just come in from outside, you've got this mudroom area, a stairwell, we'll tell you where that leads later on. Off the mudroom, a custom laundry area there with big views out onto the backyard. Now, if you're moving out to the country, what do you want? You probably want a massive garage. This one is oversized. It features four cars, two exit both onto the side and the rear of the home. It's got heated floors, custom cabinetry, a dog bath, and even a separate stairwell into the lower utility room. Welcome inside this main floor primary suite that makes you feel like you are staying at the Four Seasons. Yeah, where do you even start in a space like this? This whole wall of custom cabinetry is built in as wardrobes. You've got the bed even built in, a sitting area through here, and a gorgeous ensuite with another walk-in closet. This ensuite has a wow factor. I absolutely love the double vanity and all of these windows looking out into nature. Yeah, that's right. You know what, because this lot is so private, you don't have to worry about people peeping in the windows while you're here enjoying your air jet pedestal tub. In this home here, you've got an oversized, beautiful steam shower. And once you get out, if you're feeling a little chilly, don't worry about that because behind this drawer here, you can grab a nicely warmed towel. I love that. And not to be forgotten is this custom walk-in closet. So one of my favorite features of this primary suite is actually this deck. Do you like peace, a little solitude, a little place to get away? Well, it's south facing, so imagine in the mornings grabbing a coffee and sitting out here, enjoying a little me time. So peaceful. So the entirety of this home's floor plan is anchored by this beautiful vaulted living room space. It is absolutely gorgeous in here with the beams and the stonework, and of course those large windows that overlook your private yard. Now this is Bear's Paw, right? So it is gonna be gorgeous back here in the spring, the summer, those fall colors, even the fresh snow in the winter, partly because you get to enjoy this massive wood-burning fireplace here. I really love how cozy and grand this space feels. Isn't this room so romantic? Brad? Brad? Wherefore art thou, Brad? It is I, Tila, and the views are to the west. Wait a second, is she calling me Juliet? Either way, let's talk about this Romeo and Juliet balcony here because it's one of the most beautiful vantage points in the entire home. Remember, we've mentioned themes like mountains, the Rocky Mountains, those Albertan vibes. You really get them here with that beam design, the vaulted ceilings, and that natural stone wood burning fireplace. Now, up into this room here at the top of the stairs is this library. And take a look if you love reading books, if you like puzzling, crafts, this is an amazing spot to just squirrel away and curl up with one of your favorite bestsellers. Brad, we have a whole lot of house to show still. Stop slacking. You're right, sorry. I was just uh, caught up doing a little bit of light reading here. This one on opposites attract. Tila, that's the story of our life, right? Okay, now listen, if you want to have a nice little place to squirrel away, you maybe work from home, I've got an amazing office to show you in a second. It is, but before you do that, come with me and see the most adorable bedroom. Now check out this room. My kids would absolutely love it. There's so much space in here, tons for them to hang out with their friends in this nice little nook area. You've got a walk-in closet, all of this built-in cabinetry, and its own ensuite with a walk-in shower and that same blue granite countertop that's brought up from downstairs. Oh, are you playing with your little toys, Brad? They're not toys, Tila. They're collectibles. And finally, I can see someone else that appreciates these finer things in life, like our current owners. So if you need an incredible office space, maybe you work from home, maybe you're a CEO, maybe you run a home-based business, 
Could you imagine a room as special as this one? Huge vaulted ceilings letting all that west facing sunlight in. A great seating area here with its own home theater system. Another wood burning fireplace, a wet bar, right? We're talking, this is executive level C-suite stuff. And then of course you got this gorgeous desk here. Tila, what are you doing in my office? It is pretty great up there. Yeah, just enjoying the view? Mm -hmm. Okay, well listen, if this is your office, you're gonna have to get your real estate license. Okay, seriously though, there are a couple of incredible features here we haven't even mentioned yet, and that is just outside the door, there's a stunning half bath. But think about this, if you receive business partners, colleagues, business meetings at your home office, how great would it be to have your own separate stairwell and entrance? This one does, it's off the lower mudroom, meaning that nobody needs to come through your private home just to get into the space. I love that feature. Oh my gosh, if you love entertaining, you are gonna love this lower level. Now I'm gonna admit, this tour took a long time to film. There's a lot of house and land to capture. So we're actually showcasing this walkout basement that's normally filled with light during the evening times. But it's also going to give you some of the vibes that you might feel on a Friday night or a Saturday night hanging out here with family and friends. So at the bottom of the stairs, you enter into this open area right here. There's a great wet bar behind you. One of the coolest features is that wine cellar. We're gonna show you that in a second, but first, let's take you into the family room here because let's be honest, you're gonna be spending so much time down here watching movies, watching sports, playing games, and it's got those same cozy vibes here because there is another large gas-assisted wood-burning fireplace. Uh, there we go, there we go. Okay, I love this room. Very simply put, it gives you so many options for how you wanna live your life. Okay, now this basement features one large bedroom with a full ensuite and then a gym that walks out back into that yard. Now that gym has a half bath right beside it making it also possible for you to use it as a bedroom. With a slight conversion, you can make it into another ensuite. So with four bedrooms in this home, that beautiful entertaining space, as well as the wine cellar down here, you might wonder what this room is for. It's actually up to you. It's how you wanna live with this large table up there. You could puzzle, you could craft. You've got this great little wet bar here as well. And behind this wall here, tons of storage. Everything you need in a country home. So at the end of the hallway here is the utility room. Remember, you can step down into it from the garage and in there you will find the brains of this home. All the mechanical systems, including the newly installed home automation system. Okay, we have saved the best for last. I am absolutely in love with this custom wine room. It holds up to a thousand bottles of wine. So if you are a collector and you enjoy fine wines or scotches, you probably want a place to store them, to enjoy them and to display them but it's also important that you can keep them nice and secure. This wine room has a locked door at the front that makes this the perfect safe place to keep your collection. It's definitely my kind of safe room. Okay, but seriously though, imagine finishing off a Friday evening with friends in this space. At $3.5 million, this stunning country estate sits on four acres with a 7,000 square foot custom home. Has to be one of our favorite homes we've ever featured on our channel. And we would love to know what you thought of this tour, so please leave your comments below. That's right, and if you'd like to book a private tour of this home, all you gotta do is reach out to me, Brad McCallum with the McCallum Group. Give me a call, text, or an email. I'd be happy to set you up with a private showing of 251-096 Well and Way. Do you love touring inside some of the best homes in all of Calgary? Well, if so, we've got a full playlist of these million dollar tours right here for you to check out. And if you never wanna miss another video, you know what to do? Just subscribe.